like to introduce you to a good friend of mine. Yes, a very good friend of mine. Because I want to get that plant over to the porch because it climbs up absolutely beautifully. And now I've treated the oak, it's going to be all right. Life's about that, is finding the right tools. Now, when we're working with dogs, it's impossible, absolutely impossible for us to communicate with them in a way they will with each other. And so that's why with AB I came up with a way of achieving what we need to achieve, which is showing the dog that at times when we make the big decisions and they have to put up with it, and uh, doing it in a way that did not even remotely mean that I had to be aggressive in any way because I can with it. So hence me not trying to pick up that uh, pot and look relocate it without using the right tool. Now sometimes you're going to get it wrong and um, the other day I got it wrong. I must just show you these. These are so beautiful. Just look at that. They make me smile every day when I come to the garage. Anyway, and the bluebell's coming up because you know we all know that a lawn and I forgive me for calling this a lawn grass needs aerating and so I saw for sale these the idea is you strap now don't laugh because I know you're going to you can strap them to your feet and then you can walk across the grass yes I know she's looking at me like yeah I was here and I saw it the idea you will walk and me thinking kill two birds with one stone i will walk with those on at the same time as mowing the grass great idea <laughs> one little drawback i couldn't get my feet up because once i stay in the grass they are deep as you can see and as i tried to lift my feet up i just pushed that back so heads near it um <laughs> as i tried to step up I just fell forward. I did fall very, very slowly and very gracefully. And I was laughing. And this dog, honest to goodness, the look she gave me was like, goodness, and I have to live with you. So if you see things like that, not a good idea. Sack barrel, brilliant one. So, uh, yeah, how to make God laugh, tell you your plans. How to make a dog laugh, fall on your nose. Yes, yes. We know it was funny, and you enjoyed it. So I'm sharing the garden with you now, just put the beans in. The other stuff. I love this when this happens. The promise. This is what I see with the dog. When you're working the dog, you see that tiny little promise of what's to come. Look at this. Now I'm talking right now. Look, that tiny one little flower. The promise is it'll all come. And at the time it does that, these will probably die back. So, yeah, got me runner beans in, got me strawberries in. Yeah, we're getting there. But uh, those will be consigned to the uh, bin, I'm afraid. Well, no, I'll probably find some use for them, but it won't be with me walking in them.